Hello, Earth citizens. In this video, I will show you a 10 minute routine to do when you have cold hands and cold feet. Maybe you're somebody who has chronic cold hands, chronic cold feet, or maybe you have sometimes cold hands, sometimes cold feet, sometimes hot, sometimes all over the place. Whatever your situation is, this routine will help you bring blood, bring circulation to your extremities so that you can get some heat and blood flowing all the way to your fingertips and toes. So how we're going to do this is a good old fashioned running in place. There's nothing like running in place to quickly circulate blood, energy, everything inside to make your hands and feet warm. So now when you run in place, usually when people run, they just kind of run mindlessly. They just let their mind wander everywhere and they're just moving their muscles and that's about it. But this running in place, we're going to do it in a very mindful way. So first of all, I want you to locate an important acupressure point at the bottom of your foot. This point right here is at the base of the ball of your foot and then above the arch. So right here, about here, there's a soft, tender spot. You can feel it. It's like a soft, kind of squishy spot right here under the ball of your foot, above the arch. This is called the Yong Chan. You can find it on the other foot too. The Yong Chan is an acupressure point where you receive energy from the earth. So when you run in place, activating your Yong Chan, you can have a dramatically different effect than just running with your muscles. So we're gonna try that. Stimulating your Yong Chan also stimulates your kidneys as well to activate water energy to pump cool energy to your head, warm energy to your abdomen, and then warmth extending out to your fingers and toes. All right, so it kind of looks like this. You're gonna just run very lightly in place. But when you run, feel the bottom of your feet. Bring your mind to the bottom of your feet, especially those Yong Chun points. So it's kind of like you're pushing the ground with your Yong Chun points like this. So by using your body weight and movement, you are actually not really running. You are just pushing your Yong Chun points, making them touch the earth. So like this. Can you feel your Yong Chun? And if you can, visualize a spring, a very light spring, and you're bouncing. Your Yong Chun is bouncing against the floor, against the earth, very lightly. Okay, so we're going to run in place for two minutes, stop, and then two minutes, stop. We're gonna do a little bit of an interval work. Okay? All right, so I'll keep time. Run in place. Feel your Yong Chun. That's the most important thing. Let your mind come into your body and feel your Yong Chan. That acupressure point at the base of your foot. And run in place lightly. Very lightly. As you Push against your Yong Chan, your upper body is relaxed. Let all of your body weight go to the bottom of your foot. One minute has passed, one more minute. Keep feeling your Yong Chan. Make your steps light. Can you feel the bottom of your feet? If you can feel the bottom of your feet, you're doing a great job. Keep going. Yong Chan, Yong Chan, Yong Chan. Feel the bottom of your feet. Feet. 30 more seconds. If you're very sensitive to energy, you can already start to feel your body getting hot. You might already start to feel your palms getting a little warmer. 
Maybe your feet are getting a little warmer too. Maybe you're starting to sweat. And maybe you have some saliva forming in your mouth. These are all good signs your body is warming up. Five, four, three, two, one, and stop. Now, relax your hands, close your eyes, feel your body. With your mind's eye, scan your body from the top of your head to your fingers, to your toes, and notice what changes do you feel inside. Do you feel some warmth building in your hands? Do you feel some warmth building at your feet? Do you feel some tingling flowing through your whole body? Are you starting to sweat? Notice all of these changes. Okay, now open your eyes. Did you see some changes? We're gonna do another set of two minutes massaging your Yong Chun point and now see how this set makes you different from the first set. As you go repeat more of these sets, you'll feel a deeper level of sensation, more heat forming in your hands and feet. All right, ready? Go! Push your Yong Chun. Activate your Yong Chan. The acupressure point at the bottom of your feet, underneath the ball above the arch. Keep feeling your Yong Chan. Don't let your mind wander. Bring your mind to your feet. Can you feel your Yong Chan? Can you feel your body getting a little warmer? Maybe you're already starting to get hot. I'm feeling sweat coming on. Can you feel some sweat too? One minute passed. One more minute. Have a light step. Light step like you have a spring in your Yong Chun point and you're bouncing from the earth up and down. You're doing a great job. Yong Chun, Yong Chun. Feel your feet, feet, feet. Let your body weight come down to your feet. Thirty seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, and stop. Now, open your hands, feel your body, close your eyes, feel the top of your head down to your shoulders, arms, hands, hips, legs, feet, and notice the changes you feel now compared to before. Do your palms feel warmer? Do your feet feel warmer? Do you feel more tingling moving through your whole body? Do you feel your body temperature has gone up? Are you sweating? and you feel some saliva, more saliva forming in your mouth. These are all signs of your internal body temperature going up. When your internal body temperature goes up, you will feel your hands and feet getting warmer. Can you feel it? All right, let's do one more set. One more set of two minutes. Keep focusing on your Yong Chan and see now how your hands and feet get even warmer as you circulate more energy. Are you ready? Start! Feel your feet. Open your chest confidently. Don't slouch over. Open your chest confidently. Like you're running into an open space. You're doing great. Keep feeling your feet. 
By this point, you may feel a lot of heat moving through your body. You might feel a lot of sweat. You might feel your hands, especially the middle of your palms, are getting very hot. Notice what you feel in your body now. One minute passed, one more minute. This also is very good for grounding your energy too. A lot of the times when we think a lot, our energy is in our head, but this exercise also helps you bring energy down to your feet, making you feel stable and grounded. more seconds feel your feet 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 five four three two one and stop now relax your hands and walk around in place Walk around in a circle and notice what changes do you feel in your body now. Say out loud the changes you feel in your body now. Do your hands feel warmer? Do your feet feel warmer? Can you feel your body is more relaxed? Okay, now stop. If you can feel your hands got warmer and your feet got warmer, it's because your energy is circulating a lot. If you have a lot of stagnant energy, if you have a lot of cold energy inside of you, then it might take more repetitions until you can feel the heat. But I guarantee you, at some point when you rev up your energy like this by running in place, focusing on your Yongchun, you will feel heat in your hands and feet. Because ultimately, having cold hands, cold feet just means you have poor circulation. So this exercise will help you pump up heat pump up your blood to push it up all the way to your fingers and toes. You did a great job. To experience a full one hour brain education based class, please visit a local body and brain yoga studio near you.